What's up guys, Trizzle Trey with Triz Tech and Electronics, and in today's video, I'm bringing you guys something pretty cool. So as you guys have heard me, you saw the video that I released yesterday, which was an update video about the iOS 6 through iOS 6.1 untethered jailbreak evasion. Well, it has now been released, uh, there's been, the site has been clogged, so I just went ahead and downloaded the application uh, ahead, so you guys didn't get to see that part, but all I did was download it from evasion.com, the link will be in the description below for you to run this jailbreak. Uh, if you have not done it already. So as you can see here in my downloads, it says evasion-mac 1.0. We're going to click on that. Now it is opening evasion Mac 1.0. So this is the first mirror of any of this uh, finally downloaded. It took me forever to refresh it to get an actual download. Uh, it was an absolute disaster. It was clogged up everywhere. We have now clicked on it. We now have evasion here. We're going to click on evasion. As you can see, it says evasion application is downloaded from the internet. That's okay. We're going to say open. Now it says that it's ready for a jailbreak. So now it says that I am connected to my iPhone 5. As you can see, your iOfine Global iOS 6.1 is supported. Click jailbreak to begin. So that's what we're going to do. This is connected to my iPhone 5. I also have my iPad mini and my iPad 4 sitting over here ready for jailbreaks as well. For the purposes of this video, I figured we would go ahead and use the iPhone 5. So what we're going to do here is click jailbreak. I want you guys to make sure that you have everything backed up either to iTunes or to iCloud before you do this. Uh, another thing is make sure you do not have a pass lock on your phone. If you do, disable it now. Go into settings and dislabel the pass lock. Uh, so you just have to swipe to unlock instead of typing in any kind of digits. This is what I want. There, All jailbreaks seem to have some sort of issue with the passcode. Uh, so this is one is no different. The other thing is if you guys backed your phone up or updated to iOS 6.1, uh, over the air from the phone or whatever device you are jailbreaking, you should really go into iTunes and restore it and then update to iOS 6.1 through iTunes. I guess it's just much more uh, in depth than it is with an over the air update since so it's just laying over the top. With doing it through iTunes, it completely revamps it uh, and is running full iOS 6.1. So I would recommend you do that as well. But now that we're here, iPhone 5 Global iOS 6.1 supported, we're going to click jailbreak. Uh, I don't know how long this is going to take. This is the first time I've done it. I'm assuming that it's probably going to take quite a long time because there's thousands and thousands, if not millions of people, all doing this at the same time right now. So definitely bear with me. I'm trying to get this out as soon as possible. It was a disaster even just getting the download link for Evasion uh, version 1.0. It was just awful. Uh, I kept continuously clicking it and refreshing the page, and it kept saying the page requests were overdrawn. It was just absolutely ridiculous. But as you can see here on screen, it's now saying retrieving information from the device to generate jailbreak data. It is moving very slow. I would expect it to take between 5 to 10 minutes to do this entire jailbreak on a normal day. Uh, but with this astronomical amount of people that are trying to do this right now, it probably will take a little bit more time than that. So please bear with me. Uh, I am getting this done as soon as I can, and I really want to get this done and uploaded for your guys' viewing pleasure so that you too can have a jailbroken iPhone 5, iPad mini, any iOS device that is rocking iOS 6 through 6.1. I would recommend that you are doing this with iOS 6.1. I think that having the newest firmware is always a good idea for bug fixes and all sorts of other things, especially when you're doing something such as a jailbreak where you want everything running as top notch as possible. Now you can do these jailbreaks without doing uh, backups to iCloud or iTunes. I do recommend that you do that as I said before just in case something does brick or something does happen to your iPhone that when you restore it you will be able to back those out from iCloud or restore from iTunes so you do not lose anything. Whether it breaks or not you should be okay. Now if it completely destroys the phone well that's a different story but you know these guys work tirelessly to make sure that things like that don't happen. Now they are not responsible if something does happen to your phone uh, but evaders have been working around the clock to make sure that this happens. Now if you can see here it says waiting for your device to be ready do not touch your device. So it doesn't mean that you can't touch it and move it around. You just do not want to touch the screen. No swiping to unlock. Nothing of that sort. You just want to leave it alone. Let it run its course. And it will get done as soon as possible. There's no point in pushing it to finish faster. It will just happen as time goes on. Now I'm going to continue talking all the way through this. But I may cut the video down uh, to skip through some of this. Since it is taking a lot longer than I expected it to. It says, to continue, please unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak icon. Only tap it once. The screen will go black and return to the home screen. So now it says, uh, to continue, please unlock your device. So boom, unlocked. Uh, tap the new jailbreak icon. So we were going to find it. Now if you can see here, 
it does say there is a evaders if you can see your jailbreak icon right about here so i will just show it to you here i'm not going to switch to a different camera we are going to click the evaders jailbreak you just tap it once as you see it kicked it back out to the home screen now on the screen here you can say ejecting remount playload so it is continuously doing this jailbreak right now and it is moving at a pretty decent speed here now this is root file systems preparing final jailbreak data uh, so it is moving along quite well uh, i do have a feeling that we're probably going to have to do something from the device before city will show up on the phone uh, but maybe that isn't the case uh, we will just have to see what happens here in the next few seconds so it says jailbreak complete the device may restart a few times as it completes the process so the jailbreak has been completed now i will continue holding you guys here so that you can see that city will show up on the device itself uh, and that we will be completely 100 percent untethered jailbroken uh, I am pretty excited about this. I've been waiting quite a while. We all have. Uh, you know, I loved my jailbreak on my iPhone 4S. It was absolutely awesome, and I've been waiting so long for an iOS 6 jailbreak. And now you can see here it has the evasion uh, emblem going on. It says cleaning up, so it is finishing up the process here. Uh, but it was very hard to actually get the file onto my computer from the evasion website. But once that happened, everything moved very, very quickly. Now it says done, continuing boot. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Um, we're just letting this go ahead and finish here. If there is more news about City of Tweaks or whatever, I will let you know. Follow me on Twitter at Trizzle5586, uh, also on Instagram and the Facebook fan page, uh, but mostly Twitter. I will keep you guys up to date with any kind of changes with the iOS 6 untethered jailbreak. Uh, but so far, if you guys watch this, you will have a complete untethered jailbreak for your iOS 6 through 6.1 devices. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the Tris Tech and Electronics channel if you have not done so yet. There will be a whole lot more with iOS jailbreak tweaks from Cydia and all these things that will be uploaded to the channel in the coming days. So definitely subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will catch you guys in the next video. Take care guys. Peace.